Oh, hello there. It's me, Matt. Just out here um, thinking about youth group. It starts this Sunday. I don't know if you knew that. It starts this Sunday. And, uh, well, we have a youth group in person again and virtually. And there's a couple of things you might need to know about youth group this year. So while you're here, why don't I just share a few of those things? First thing you need to know is that you're going to need a mask. You're going to need a mask. We are going to need masks because we're trying to keep each other safe. You're also gonna need a chair too, maybe like this one, or a blanket, or a towel, or just whatever you use to be outside. Because, by the way, we're probably gonna be outside most of the year, so. Along with that, you're also gonna to wanna to bring the right clothes and shoes, especially because they actually just aerated, which is great timing. So, it might be a little bit muddy some days. And uh, you're gonna to wanna to bring a water bottle, something to stay hydrated, it's a good idea. Might, maybe it'll be nice and cool or warm, we don't know. And uh, you're going to want to make sure you bring your forms. There's a couple forms that you need to fill out, a covenant and medical or waiver release thing. And uh, you're going to want to make sure you bring those. But just remember, there's always a virtual option. Anytime we do anything, there's going to be a virtual option there too. So don't feel like you're going to be missing out. Now, if you're possibly sick, like if you're having symptoms like, you know, the uh, runny nose, congestion, coughing, sore throat, body ache, muscle ache, headache, uh, loss of, a re new loss of taste or smell, virtual option is gonna be a great choice for you. Or if you've been exposed to somebody who has tested positive, that's gonna be a great option. And just so you know, exposed means that you've been within six feet of somebody who has tested positive for more than 15 minutes. So that's the, that's the official definition. Now, I realize that there's a lot that's new here. Oh, actually, I should probably mention something else that's new. The time. So middle school is meeting from 4 to 5 p.m. and high school is meeting 6.30 to 7.30. So it's only an hour, 4 to 5 p.m. for middle school, high school 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. Also, the welcome center is going to be in a new place. And that's where you're going to turn on those forms. It's going to be in the front front uh, porch of the congregation house. And your small groups are going to be in locations. You actually might be where I'm sitting right here, back in the corner. It's quite nice. The congregation house is right there, basketball court's right there. And you might have even have some sm new small group leaders. Depend depending on your group, there might be some new ones, which is a great opportunity because they're all really awesome. Really excited about that. But there's still a lot that's the same about youth group this year. No matter whether you're virtual or in person, youth group, what's going to be the same? You're going to be welcomed by friends and adult leaders who care about you. You're going to be part of a group that is here to love God, love others, and love life and do that together. So thanks for joining me for a few minutes. Look forward to seeing you soon.